Hi, we are from At Home Tuition. In this video, we are going to see few examples based on equations reducible to the linear form. The first question is solve x plus 1 divided by 2x plus 3 equal to 13. So, solution. First, you are writing the given equation as such. And if you look into the given equation, we observe that this equation is not linear equation. Because if you look into the left hand side, it is not a linear. But if you can make into linear by cross multiplying this. That is you are multiplying 2x plus 3 on both the sides of the equation. You can make it linear. So now first step we are multiplying 2x plus 3 on both the sides of the equation. So 2x plus 3 times x plus 1 divided by 2x plus 3 equal to 2x plus 3 times 3 by 8. Now I am simplifying this. So 2x plus 3, 2x plus 3 will get cancelled. You have only x plus on 1 on the left hand side. And if you go with the right hand side you can use distributive property. So 2x into 3 by 8 plus 3 into 3 divided by 8. Next step, we are simplifying the right hand side. So, x plus 1 equal to 6x divided by 8 plus 9 by 8. So, now if you look into this, the denominator 8 is common. So, we are taking it out and we are adding the numerator. So, 6x plus 9, x plus 1 equal to 6x plus 9 divided by 8. Now, we are multiplying by 8 on both the sides to remove this denominator. So, 8 into x plus 1 equal to 8 into 6x plus 9 divided by 8. So, this 8 in the numerator, 8 in the denominator will get cancelled. So, you will get only 6x plus 9. Now, we are using distributive property on the left hand side. So, you will get 8 into x is 8x plus 8 into 1 is 8 equal to 6x plus 9. Now, we are transposing 6x from the right hand side to left hand side. So, the equation will be 8x plus 8 minus 6x equal to 9. So, if on rearranging, we will get 8x minus 6x plus 8 equal to 9. And simplifying, we will get 2x. So, 8x minus 6x is 2x plus 8 equal to 9. Next step, we are transposing 8 from left hand side to right hand side. So, you will get 2x equal to 9 minus 8. 9 minus 8 is 1. 2x equal to 1. Dividing by 2 on both the sides, we get 2x divided by 2 equal to 1 by 2. x equal to 1 by 2. So, thus we can conclude that x equal to 1 by 2 is the solution to the given equation. Now, let us verify our solution by substituting x equal to 1 by 2 in the given equation. So, the given equation is x plus 1 divided by 2x plus 3 equal to 3 by 8. Now, we are substituting only on the left hand side that is x equal to 1 by 2. So, 1 by 2 plus 1 divided by 2 into 1 by 2 plus 3. So, 1 by 2 plus 1. So, now what you are doing? We are making the denominator same to add these two numbers. So, 1 by 2 plus here we have 1. So, we are making it 2 into 1 divided by 2 into 1 divided by this 2 and this 2 will get cancelled. You will get only 1 plus 3. So, now this will be 1 by 2 plus 2 into 1 is 2 divided by 2 into 1 is 2 divided by 1 plus 3 is 4. So, now here the denominator 2 is common. We are taking it out and we are adding the numerator. So, 1 plus 2 divided by 2 divided by 4. Now, we have the equation 3 divided by 2 divided by 4 divided by 1. So, now for dividing the rational numbers, we know that we have to convert division into multiplication and we have to interchange the numerator and denominator. So, 3 divided by 2 into 1 divided by 4. Now, you can multiply the numerator and denominator separately. So, the numerator is 3 into 1 divided by 2 into 4. Which 3 into 1 is 3 divided by 2 into 4 is 8. So, left hand side is 3 divided by 8. It is already given in the question that is right hand side is 3 by 8. So, left hand side is equal to right hand side. And we can conclude that the equation is balanced. And therefore, we can say x equal to 1 by 2 is the correct solution to the given equation. Next question. Present ages of Anu and Raj are in the ratio 4 is to 5. 8 years from now, the ratio of their ages will be 5 is to 6. Find their present ages. So, solution. First, they are given in the ratio. So, let us consider the common ratio of their ages be x. So, now we will write present age of Anu is 4x and present age of Raj is 
5x. Then in our question, it's given that 8 years from now, that is after 8 years, their age is in the ratio 5 divided by 6. That is Anu age divided by Raj age is 5 divided by 6. So, now 8 years from now, Anu age will become, so now we have considered Anu age as 4x. So, 8 years after, it will be 4x plus 8. Now, at present, Raj age is 5x. So, after five, 8 years, it will be 5x plus 8. Now, we will write that in the equation form. That is Anu age 4x plus 8 divided by Raj age, that is 5x plus 8, equal to 5 divided by 6. Now, we are going to cross multiply the denominators to make it as a linear equation. So, 6, you are multiplying it to the left hand side and this 5x plus 8 in the denominator of left hand side, you are multiplying it in the right hand side. So, the equation will become 6 into 4x plus 8 equal to 5 into 5x plus 8. Now, we are using distributive property, 6 into 4x plus 6 into 8 equal to 5 into 5x plus 5 into 8. So, 6 into 4x is 24x plus 6 into 8 is 48 equal to 5 into 5x is 25x plus 8 into 5 is 40. Next step, we are transposing 25x to the left hand side. So, the equation will be 24x plus 48 minus 25x equal to 40. And rearranging the equation, 24x minus 25x plus 48 equal to 40. 24x minus 25x is minus x plus 48 equal to 40. Next step, transposing this 48 to right hand side. So, minus x equal to 40 minus 48, that is minus x equal to minus 8. Now, we are dividing by minus 1 on both the sides. So, you will get x equal to 8. But we considered x as the common ratio. So, present age of Anu, we have taken it as 4x. So, 4 into 8 is 32. And present age of Raj, we have taken it as 5x. So, 5 into 8 is 40. So, therefore, we can say that present age of Anu is 32 years and that of Raj is 40 years. Next question, solve the following equation. 8x minus 3 divided by 3x equal to 2. Solution. So, first step, we are writing the given equation as such and we are multiplying by 3x on both the sides to remove the denominator. So, 3x into 8x minus 3 divided by 3x equal to 3x into 2. So, now this 3x in the numerator, 3x in the denominator will get cancelled. So, left hand side will be 8x minus 3 equal to 3 in x into 2 is 6x. <coughs> so, next step, we are transposing this 8x from left hand side to right hand side. So, minus 3 equal to 6x minus 8x. On simplifying, we will get minus 3 equal to minus 2x. Then, we are dividing by minus 2 on both the sides. So, minus 3 divided by minus 2 equal to minus 2x divided by minus 2. So, you will get 3 by 2 equal to x. So, thus x equal to 3 by 2 is the solution to the given equation. Now, we will verify our solution by substituting in the given equation. So, the given equation is 8x minus 3 divided by 3x equal to 2 and we have found that x equal to 3 by 2. Now, we are substituting in the left hand side of the equation. So, 8 into x is 3 by 2 minus 3 divided by 3 into 3 by 2. So, on simplifying, 8 times 3 is 24 divided by 2 minus 3 divided by 9 divided by 2. So, 24 divided by 2 is 12 minus 3 divided by 9 divided by 2. 12 minus 3 is 9 divided by 1 divided by 9 by 2. 9, we are writing it as 9 divided by 1. Now, this is division. So, we are converting it into multiplication and we are interchanging the numerator and denominator. So, we get 9 into 2 divided by 1 into 9. So, 9 2s are 18 divided by 9. So, if you simplify, you get 2. So, left hand side is 2 and it is given that right hand side is 2. So, left hand side is equal to right hand side and we can conclude that both the sides of the equation are balanced. Therefore, x equal to 3 by 2 is the correct solution to the given equation. Hope you have understood all the questions well. Thank you for watching the video.